Ready? Ready. I see a little bit of movement up in front of us right here. Oh yeah, I see that too. Gotta go find some fish. Watch this. Easy money. Oh shit, look over there. Oh shit. Oh shit, what? Are you serious? What the? Well, I don't know what that was, but <laughs> what's going on YouTube? Erica Lynn here, welcome back to another video. Garrett and I just got out to our first spot this morning. Um, we're already seeing activity, so I was gonna do an intro before we started fishing, but <laughs> we're just already seeing a bunch of activity. So um, we got top waters on first since it's pretty early. Um, Visibility is pretty low, so we're just gonna, gonna be chasing around some wakes and some activity that we're seeing out here. Uh, Oh, like that. yeah, like that. Oh, there's another big one. Oh, crap. Oh, hit. Yeah, I see that. Oh, my gosh, he missed it. Yeah, oh, shut up. Dang. I just had one following it. Come on. Oh, what the heck is that? It's a barracuda. This is not what we expected this morning. A little barracuda to start the morning. That's definitely what your first fish was. Yeah, the barracuda because how fast he ran. All right, first fish, you guys. Hopefully we got a couple redfish, not so many cuda, but that's a first on the new skiff. Oh, what? Oh, <laughs> I thought he was hooked. Here, I thought that was a redfish hit and we got a ladyfish. The other really skinny fish out here. Oh, what is that? Nothing we want. Needlefish. Needlefish. Skin. Fish out here besides the barracuda. Oh, quick release. Oh, Skinny barracuda. Oh. <laughs> you fall, start falling. Did you see that? Did you really? Know? Yeah. Of course, maybe because I got this. Maybe. Yeah, I got a little leaf with it. That's probably why. This is actually kind of perfect for a sheephead. That'd actually be a really cool catch. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't think I've definitely haven't caught one of those on fly. I am throwing this little shrimp fly, a little tan thing, a little fuzz. Should be pretty good on the sand. Another sheep head. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> he didn't move like strip, strip. He's on it. He followed it. Let him eat it. Oh. Be all over it. Let it sit. No, he bumped off a bit. He doesn't like when it stops moving, does he? No. I thought I heard, I thought I felt him like pick at it though for a second. Yeah. To... Well, good to know they're super interested in this. Yes. Oh, Let, no, under. it's under the boat. <laughs> Hang on. Let him run, let him run. Oh, okay, I'm free. Watch the pole. Is this a sheep head? Yeah, I think so. Nuh uh. We were casting at what we thought was a redfish or something. 
It is a sheep head. It is a sheep head. Let him run. Yeah, I saw the tail and I thought it was a shark, to be honest. Yeah. He's trying to push his face on the ground. Heck yeah. I'm gonna walk him to you. That's a big one too. Yeah, that's a nice one. Dang, they really like this tan fly that we we're throwing first. It looked a lot like a little shrimp. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. First she <laughs> first she fell on fly. Heck yeah. Sick. That's what we needed. Check out how this fish is barely hooked. Is he really? Yeah, just oh my on gosh, the skin on the inside of his mouth. Hooked. That's the hard part about these sheep head. Their teeth are just so hard to get past. All right, first sheep head on fly um, and actually first sheep head on the new skiff. Um, I've caught one black jump, also part of the jump family, but first sheep head um, ever, so very awesome. We'll go ahead and get this one back in the water since we're not keeping them today. You ready? Yeah. All right. He's probably gonna dart off pretty fast. <laughs> there he goes down the bottom already. Nice. Yes. Just in time, we got some storms coming in. Eating on that and it cold is a front. Super low tide. Nice. Good job. So we're just about to move spots after that sheephead, and we just saw what we saw earlier, like a little red tailing up at shore. So <laughs> Garrett's on it. We'll see. Uh, you see him? Have the power pull in, so we're anchored up right now. Oh, what was that? Needlefish. Oh. It's gotta be right here. Oh. Good cast. Oh, oh, it's a mullet. That got me excited. Mm. It's crazy for how low the tide is right now. It's pretty deep. Yeah, like pretty in this, deep here. I mean, deep as in a foot, <laughs> two feet maybe. Plenty to hold fish. But when you can see the difference between the water line and the mangroves there of how low it is and how high it usually does sit. So yeah, like all this, this flat that's eight inches deep right now, or this edge of right here, I should say, is three foot deep by the end of the night. Oh yeah, it'll be back up to the top of those mangroves. Mm -hmm. So all those bait fish, all that activity that's usually up in the mangroves has to be pushed out into this. Yeah, I saw. I what it was, but I saw mm -hmm. a couple of Yeah, I did too. I can't tell. Where is a redfish? I know there's going to be one sitting in this grass here. The viz just went down a little bit with this cloud cover. Just yeah, looking for like a little red, not even little, big red shadow. That was what we're looking for. When I checked the weather this morning, there's some big red cells like moving uh, towards shore. And there they are. <laughs> oh. I think that's post hurricane. Got stuck up on yeah, the seawall. So a little behind the scenes, I've been trying to film and get footage for you guys of me catching fish for like five different trips now. And I'm just in like some sort of slump that I don't know why the fishing gods are not <laughs> like allowing me to catch any fish for you guys, but made it happen on today's video. I have been trying to film for you guys. So I have plans to get more and more videos out. So make sure to like subscribe if you guys haven't already and we will see you guys next time.
I made it back just before this thunderstorm buzz about to take off. Uh, if you guys did notice, this is my brand new 2023 South Dates gift. I'm gonna do a full walkthrough in the next video. We have a few more parts that we're still waiting on. Um, so I will show you guys the entire boat in detail. I'm super excited to show it off. Um, so that'll be in the next video. But otherwise, if you guys didn't catch it, we did have the live streaming of the giveaway for my last boat. Um, I have it live on my Instagram. So if you guys wanna go watch who won my skiff, um, you guys can uh, check that out there. It seems like our skip winner was the perfect match because Thomas is already catching tarpon, snook, some badass uh, inshore fish on the new skiff. So congrats, Thomas. I hope you love the boat. And otherwise, I will see you guys next time.